September 12th, which is actually my birthday. We got our jewelry. How do you feel? I feel like I made, I feel great. I made the first commitment. We're committing to things. <laughs> Welcome back to the vlogs. It is Thursday at 1.30 in the afternoon. We have a jam-packed day. So we have two events that we're going to tonight with Glow Recipe and Ilya. I'm really excited about. I'm going to start getting ready for that around 3 o'clock. It starts at 6. So I feel like that's enough time for me to kind of film, get my makeup done, and be ready and prepared. Okay, let me show you the dress. So I got it from Amazon like I mentioned to you guys earlier. It's actually really cute on. So here she is. She's a long number. I said, let me do a long red dress. Because I don't have any red dresses. And I was like, let me do a long one. So it's like a satin type of dress. It has like this little cuff, a little fold over in the front. And then this is what the back looks like. It's actually out. I could have got an extra small, but I got a small because I didn't have an extra small. So I just took a chance. But I think if it's pretty good, especially since it's a silky dress, it's supposed to fit a little bit looser so that it kind of looks flowy. So I'm not mad at it. Um, and then I'm thinking about wearing these little fuzzy heels from Revolve. I've got hair on them. There's hair everywhere. What are you doing? Okay, so these little fuzzy heels from Revolve, which I think are super cute. And then I'm torn between wearing this bag with it, just like a cute little shoulder bag moment. Because um, I'm only bringing my phone, wallet, and you guys which i'll probably end up holding the whole night um so i'm like i need a little tiny bag because the clutch i want to bring i can't hold anything my phone doesn't even fit in there i don't think so i probably will end up taking this one even though my first month to take the clutch i don't know i'll figure it out but <sighs> that's what we're doing for outfit and then i'm gonna deck it out with gold jewelry um yeah that's pretty much it i can't believe i finished so early I was expecting to take a lot longer than I did, and I didn't. And then I still think I'm trying to get used to this hair on me, because I've had braids, and the braids were like a lighter color. You guys saw them in my last vlog. So I'm like, dark hair, who is she? I don't know her. So that's what we're doing. I will come back when we are on our way to the event. Good morning! It's Saturday. It is currently 10 a.m. I am dressed. I filmed the video. I've been very productive this morning. We're actually about to head out. We're going to go to my friend Brianna's house because we're going to spend the whole day in Pasadena. We're going to have like a cute little girl's day. We're going to go grab coffee, go to the Pasadena flea market, and then we're going to go to a bookstore. So I've been on TikTok and I've been on this reading a lot of books wave right now. Like I don't know I just feel like feeding my brain and like helping me broaden my horizon when it comes to thinking communicating and just existing in this world um, in general because I feel like there's certain areas that I lack so I want to improve those things um, so we're gonna go to a bookstore it's just gonna be a super cute just chill day and 
I'm excited. So I'm gonna take you guys with me. Let's go. guys so we're actually getting permanent jewelry and i'm really excited me and brianna are going to get matching butterfly anklets i'm going to show you once she gets hers but it's so cute How do you feel? I feel like I made, I feel great. I made the first commitment. We're committing to things <laughs> in 2023. Yeah, so I love the way my necklace came out. I think it's so cute. Yeah. It's like a little pop. Let's show the girls your bracelet. I got the dainty B for so free. Cute. B for free. B okay, for B. Free. <laughs> and then I got my little anklet. It's so cute. I'll show you guys later, but it looks really cute. Good morning, or I should say good afternoon. Good afternoon, happy Monday. It is currently 1-ish p.m. I got up a little bit late, so I'm a little behind schedule. I was supposed to get up at 6, I ended up getting up at 9, and I had to get some filming done. I need to get some editing done. I need to respond to emails. I was late on just so many things. So, ow. So, this week has been a lot um, in a nutshell I recently got hacked on Instagram and they literally hacked my account was trying to get into my email they were like you're not getting your account back unless you pay us like they were trying to extort me for my own account and it's so crazy like that you can work so hard for something and somebody that you don't even know tries to ruin it thankfully I got on like top of things with Instagram and after i calmed down because i was flipping out i was losing my marbles like i was really angry and i just feel like because i don't bother people like i don't play games with people like i don't do that type of stuff like i don't aggravate and like try to bring somebody down or attack them and like that's just not what i do and for someone who i don't even know to feel like they have the right to violate me like i felt very violated and like i don't know i just don't feel safe so 
I haven't really been in the best state of mind when it comes to posting, but I have to. So, yeah, that happened. I was overwhelmed. Other personal things in my life has been happening and occurring. I was also recently in a car accident. I was also recently in a car accident, as some of you may know, if you watch my last vlog. And it's just like been a whirlwind of like things. The amount of times that I have cried already. Oh, and I'm not done. I know that like, there's going to be some more like tears shed throughout the week. Um, that's just where I'm at currently in life. <laughs> um, so I've just been exceptionally overwhelmed and overstimulated but I have so many things that I have to get done. I have so much that I have to do. And it's like, when it rains, it pours and sometimes it hurricanes. Right now, it's like, it's kind of like in a hurricane phase for me. And maybe it's because I'm about to elevate. Someone really close to me told me that I am about to like, really, I don't know, blossom in the next year or next couple months or something because that's why it's trying to bring me down. So. I'm going to listen to that advice and just try to stay focused and not get all worked up and just try to do my best. So today we're about to head to a coffee shop with my friend Brianna. You guys seen her a few days ago in this vlog. And we're going to go to a coffee shop and just edit and just like get some work done. And I'm really excited. I've been trying to get more out of the house when it comes to work as far as like my editing locations because at home when it comes to editing I take a really long time because I procrastinate because I'm like oh I'm at home I'll get it done I'll get it done and the next thing you know I'm going off to dinner or going out to do something else and I don't edit so I'm trying to move my office out in different locations so I did a pretty good job so far last week I went to another coffee shop and got some work done so this week I'm gonna go to a different coffee shop get some work done that's what we're doing on this Monday I hope you guys are enjoying the vlogs what else that's pretty much it so let's head out also the love that I have for this hat this hat is like I'm in love with this hat and I will wear this hat every chance I get it's so cute and it just I don't know I just love it it just brings me comfort for some reason anyway I will see you guys once we make it to the coffee shop I'm dressed really chill just some jeans and a t-shirt my hat those are the vibes so i'll see you guys when we get to our destination hi babes welcome back to the vlogs happy tuesday it's currently like five o'clock it's 5 51 welcome back to the vlogs today is september 12th which is actually my birthday 
crazy thing is, there's a couple crazy things. Let's sit you guys down. Crazy thing. So it's actually a couple of crazy things. Today's my birthday, which it doesn't feel like it. I've never been the type of person who like goes crazy for their birthday. I just kind of like take it easy. I'm a very chill babe. Like I'm just, I just be chilling. I turned 30 today. Like I feel healed. I woke up a whole new person. Like trauma we don't know her sadness we don't know her depression we don't know her anxiety we don't know her. <laughs> i'm leaving that in my 20s um yeah i'm 30 and i feel great i'm really excited for this generation of my life like i'm really excited to see all of the growth the amount of growth that i experienced towards the end of my 20s has been the most exciting scary fun terrifying thing that I've ever done in my life and I think whenever you enter an era it's always weird and it's crazy and it's a roller coaster ride of ups and downs and then when you're leaving an era it's the same type of way but you have a little bit more knowledge and I feel like going into my 30s I feel very secure and it might sound weird that I'm saying I feel secure now but I feel like in your 20s you're constantly trying to fit in you're trying to find yourself you're trying to figure out where you belong at least I was and I know a lot of people who are my age or older who, who have been in their 20s they're like yeah like you're trying to find yourself it's a discovery journey and my 20s were a bit traumatic they were a bit on the traumatic side and I am not gonna lie I am really excited for the amount of personal self-growth that I've been applying to myself and like the people I've been surrounding myself with and just feeling really good so I went to breakfast this morning it was just kind of like an intimate thing it was really special it was really nice I had a really good time and I don't know it just meant a lot to me and I feel like leaving oh my god I'm not gonna to cry oof I'm trying to be a crybaby in my 30s that's what I'm trying not to do I'm a very emotional creature but it was just a really special moment and just kind of you know how you're in a moment and you realize like your life kind of flashes before your eyes and you see like your whole entire life like it just goes like this and in that moment you just snap back into it and you're like okay like this will be worth it and I feel like I had that moment and it was a beautiful experience I had so much fun it was like a highlight to my day now I just got done filming I did my hair makeup and I'm still in a t-shirt I'm chilling but I'm about to get dressed in a bit because we are gonna go to dinner with Shanice and Brianna and we're gonna go have like a little girls dinner I wasn't gonna do anything for my birthday because I don't know if I mentioned this but I'm not I don't really do anything for my birthday I don't really make a big fuss about it I've never done that like maybe one year I'll make like a huge thing out of it but I just I'm I'm too busy. I'm thinking about all these other things I could be putting my time into and money into and you know what I mean? Like all of this effort into so like just like becoming a better person, working on myself, healing, forming like meaningful bonds and relationships is like the highlight of my 30s. Like going into my 30s, I really want to solidify the people who are going to be in my life forever um, to the mu as much as I can, you know, to the max of my ability um but just like really solid strong friendships and groups and just feeling really confident and elevated and like the amount of confidence I feel in myself today is like something I've never experienced in my 20s like I feel so good and it might sound funny because I turned 30 today but it's just been my mindset has been changing and growing and evolving since before I even turned 30 um over the last couple of months just really trying to grow and like not be this ball of trauma moving and navigating through the world so with that being said I'm 30 today um I'm really excited so I'm about to just chill it's really hot in here I'm gonna get dressed in a little bit I'm gonna take you guys to dinner with me and we're just gonna hang out like there's nothing crazy going on because I'm a chill babe but you're gonna spend my birthday with me. So let's go. Come on, let's go. I was like, no, let's go to dinner. Okay, okay so they dragged me out. Say hi, guys. Brianna. No, we have to go to dinner. I was like, girl, we're going out. We're going out. Yes, this is a big birthday. I'm really excited to have friends like these. I feel special. Let me get out of the house. I love this for us. We're trying to start a girl group. That's our. <laughs> 
Like we want, like we need a good, like solid core.